Good morning, everybody. It's minus eight on Wednesday morning. Minus six will be your high later today. This is always one of my favorite segments to do. Sarah Daniel is here, beauty editor with Fashion Magazine, and your 13th annual Reader's Choice Beauty Awards are in the February issue. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for having I've me. I've always been a junkie for, <laughs> like, everything on here, makeup and moisturizers, and I love yours because it's chosen by people who use it, That's the right. readers. Yes, our readers. So 8,000 people voted uh, online and they told us what they loved, everything from moisturizer to mascara. And I've brought a few of the items here today to share with you. So I love this. This bottle, yes. this Clinique bottle takes me back. Because in my teens when I thought, okay, got to get serious about my <laughs> skin. <laughs> and you would get that, the, th the three steps. And you get that big, big bar of soap. <laughs> and I think it was like a toner and this. And but the, it's a great product. It's so. been around actually since the late '60s. That's and it, it's still a, you know very like a bestseller in the skincare department. So it was one of our winners. Not surprising at all. And women love the texture and they love that it's very hydrating as well. So mm -hmm. they've actually updated the formula slightly to add hyaluronic acid, so it's even more hydrating. Oh, interesting. And uh, Aveeno. Aveeno. So everyone needs a great hand cream, especially at this time of year. So this one has oatmeal in it. Um, it's very soothing. And the great thing about it, and they even call it out on the label, I, I think, is that it lasts through a hand washing. So you know at this time of year, you're washing your hands all the time, oh, and they're getting dry. So this one, you don't have to apply as often because it has the staying power to last through hand washing. All right. So is this face masks that we yeah, have Yeah, two face masks. So that uh, Biore was our winner in the under $10 category in Clinique and the over 10 They both do similar things in that they purify the skin, tighten the pores, reduce oil. They use different ingredients. Um, Biore has the uh, has charcoal and the uh, Clinique product has uh, clay. And the other thing we've been talking about a lot this week is masking, multi-masking. And so using a variety of different masks at the, to, same, time? At the same time to target yeah, different I, problems. I don't even know about this. That's <laughs> exciting. <laughs> <laughs> so that's so so these and the other great thing about the Bora thing is it warms on contact. You only have to wear it for a minute, and then we'll rinse it off. So it's easy to incorporate into your daily skincare routine. Whenever I see the. A Biore brand. I just can always picture myself when I lived in Calgary sitting with that darn strip. The poor on my strips. Nose. <laughs> I know. That's, their, that's a very popular that product. Was their, yeah, that, that changed everything. Brows are big. Brows are huge. And I think Cara Delevingne, that model with those incredible brows, has really driven this category. Um, and this is actually the first year we have this category in our awards. So the two winners here were Maybelline Define a Brow and Benefits Gimme Brow. And I was, as I was mentioning earlier, this uh, the Benefit product has hair like fibers in it. So okay. you brush it through your brow and the hair-like fibers adhere to your brow, actually building it up, making it appear fuller. And it's incredible. We're back to that Brooke Shields 80s kind of totally. brow, right? Totally. You want that. You Wait, don't want the 90s. The you don't want to over tweeze. The Evangelista situation. Ac exactly. And this, I, you know, I know here, I never do a thing to my brows, really. Um, when I'm not here, like if I'm going out for the night. Right. But it makes all the difference when you fill them in a little bit, and then I, I do always do this part, but not the fill-in part, yeah. and they always do that to me here. This one is a waxy pencil that you can sort of fill in little gaps and things, so yeah. it just defines it and makes it a little, a little bit fuller. Mm -hmm. And next? Exfoliator. So St. Ives often wins in this category. Uh, again, this time of year, people need to exfoliate in order for their moisturizers to work better. This has crushed apricot in it, and it's, again, a reader favorite. It's one year after year. Mm-hmm. Tresemme dry shampoo. Uh, dry shampoos is another dry big shampoo. category. A savior for so many women. Love it so much. Yes. So can I squirt this a little bit? Sure. So here's the thing about dry shampoo, and I have tried a lot of them. They can be too uh, perfumey. They can. This one actually has a fairly light scent. It's a citrusy scent, um, it's and bad, the, it's the, bad, the mist is quite good. The powder is, is it's not too much powder, so it absorbs the oil around your hairline and on your part. That would be just my, my advice to all dry shampoo people: dial down the perfume factor. But it's, so this one works, though. Obviously, the readers like it. Yeah, readers love it. Um, and then the uh, curling iron up here. This is a Conair curling iron. Doesn't look like a typical curling iron. It's sort of the next generation curling iron. So I've seen this on TV. Does this work for really real? It reels? truly, truly works. Women love. It. It's won two years in a row now, and it's it's basically foolproof in that you just um, clamp it down near your root. It pulls the hair in for you. It has a time. Yeah, kind of like sucks in your hair. <laughs> yes, but it's not dangerous in that if it doesn't pull it in the right way, it will release it immediately. It's not sort of stuck to your head, and it has two settings for temperature and time. So the tighter, the, the longer the time, the tighter the curl. And a lot of women are sort of you know looking at celebrities like Lord and Solange Knowles and wanting those curls but not having the time or the skill to do you know a full head of curls every morning, so this makes it really easy. Let's blast through these last three. Concealer? 
Concealer, everyone needs a great concealer. The winner in the um, uh, above $15 category was MAC, and under 15 was CoverGirl. Those are, they're both easy to use. CoverGirl, uh, you can apply with a doe foot applicator here, so it's easy to do on the go, to do little touch-ups for mm -hmm. dark circles under your eyes. And um, for lips, to, uh, for in the lipstick category, Revlon just put in um, lip stain, or sorry, uh, balm stain. It's sort of a balm uh, stain hybrid, so it, it's moisturizing like a balm, but it gives you the color payoff of a lip stain. So it's also great at this time of year when your lips are dry. I like that. And, and Burt's Bees is a, a classic moisturizing lip balm, and they've actually got a few uh, tinted shades as well, so you can have a little bit of color on your lips as well. Fashion Magazine's 13th Annual Reader's Choice Beauty Awards in the February issue. Sarah Daniel, thank you so much. Thanks for having me. Great talking to you. We're going to take a break. We'll be right back.